So without using a lie detector, how can you know if the person who broke your trust is now telling you the truth? Well, here's the honest truth about that. You can't know 100% for sure. We can't even if we use a lie detector. Even lie detector machines aren't 100% reliable. So in my opinion, the best thing to do is ask for full access to all the ways your partner spends money and all the way they all the ways they use to communicate. Because it's really hard to have an affair if you have to account for all of your money and all of your time and all of the ways that you're communicating. So if you have access to your partner's, you know, phone, email, social media, um, their bank accounts, their credit cards, their car, all these other things, you should be able to tell if for the most part, they're telling you the truth about what they're doing and where they're spending time and how they're, um, you know, how they're spending their money. I would say give them a bit of trust, maybe just 5% and see how are they doing? Is what they're telling you matching up with the data you're seeing in these accounts? If it is, give them 5% more trust. But if there are any anomalies, anything that doesn't match up, jump on that, talk about it and say, we've, we've got to sort this out because anytime there's a breakdown in, you know, trust, anytime there's a breakdown in you telling me something and it doesn't match up with the data, it just sinks our trust back down to zero. So we have to keep building layer upon layer. Hope that helps.